Bizzarini. You think maybe it's an Italian car? Maybe, just maybe. Here we go, first look. Looks amazing. For those of you that don't know, Giotto Bizzarini worked on the original Lamborghini V12 way back in the 1960s. So this car is gonna pay tribute to that, pay tribute to the founder of Bizzarini. Back in the 60s, they had a sports car I cannot think of the name. What's the name of that car? It had the Chevrolet 327 in it. And I believe it also had a V12, a V12 as well. This is gonna be an amazing super sports car. We don't know much about it other than it's a limited run. It's gonna be powered by a Cosworth, potentially a Cosworth V12 that's normally aspirated and made it to an eight speed dual clutch transmission. That's good news. V12 naturally aspirated, good news. Eight speed dual clutch, good news. Manual would be nice, but dual clutches are great. What's great is I don't hear anything about an electric version because we do not need an electric version of this car that weighs 2,500 pounds more than the V12 version. This is gonna be cool. What do you guys think? Looking forward to this one? Would you buy a Bizzarini? Do you, are you fans of the original? The 5300 GT, that's the name I was looking for. The 5300 GT. What do you guys think? Looking forward to this one? Do we need another pasta rocket like this? I say, why not? I mean, who doesn't love a good pasta rocket?